now that we've fixed the mast, quote unquote, we got rid of all the stuff sitting on it. We have now unlocked a new part of it. As you can see, Elio and his wife, it, it, not Elio's wife, <laughs> Briggs' wife isn't here. They're not down here. Like I said, it, like you want to see that is oh, the blood. Hey, now we can raise the mast and set use it to set sail again. Yeah, mate. Let's go tell the mayor the good news. Yeah, let's do that. I keep forgetting when the triggers happen for these little conversation things. It, well, the cutscenes in it because if you're holding B, it goes through. The text log, it just it, it just skips it. But ba 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 boo boo. Is that it, Elio? What are you? Oh, oh, what is it, Elio? What are you so excited about? Ba 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 boo boo. It's true. The block that was pinning down the mast is gone. You were the ones who did it, weren't you? Yeah. I knew you would do it someday. Still, Briggs will be pleased when he hears about this. Well then, let's go tell him. And they're off. Well, let's make sure... Oh. I still can't quite believe that the stone block on top of the mask has totally vanished. I'm telling you, Mayor. I saw it with my own eyes. I mean, I didn't see it. It's gone. If you don't believe us, go see it for yourself. I will say I don't remember any of these guys' voices, so it's probably going to be completely different. Huh? What? Whoa, hey! It's gone. That huge block is really gone. Excellent news, man. Unfortunately, the mayor of Marja will probably try to take it away from us now. Well, technically, it's their boat. <laughs> but that can wait. Who was able to move the block? Felix! Felix, did you do this? Surprised to see us, mayor? Did you do this? We left El Hafra some time ago, but we just returned and destroyed the stone block. Well, everything else. Exploring? What brought you back to El Hafra? Now? Felix had a hunch we might be needed here. Mayor, not to interrupt, but should we begin repairs on your ship now? Yes, yes, you're right, of course. Gather the townspeople and get them to work on the mast. Yes, sir. We're on our way. We shouldn't need too many people to raise that mast. All right, I'm counting on you. Destroying that stone must have been quite a challenge. Why don't you come back to my manor and get some rest? Uh, sure. Why not? You're too kind, Mega. We'd be happy to. Yo, Gin Mayor, you keep a fine house. Oh, don't be silly. You've done a great deed. It was the least I could do. Even if he gets the boat fixed, I don't think he's going to hand it over to Marjorie. I agree. He's being way too nice for me not to be a little suspicious of him. I'm sorry. Did you girls have something you'd like to share with us? I see. And this is kind of one of those time passes, but <laughs> they talk about random stuff that doesn't matter, and at least not enough to really warrant them making text for it. Chaya, how are the repairs coming along? Things seem 
to be moving slowly down there. And oh, things? These things take time! Sir, there's a problem! Calm down, man. You're a soldier. What are you being so flustered about? Briggs destroyed the prison and escaped with his pirates. What? I, are you? Were you asleep while this was going on? Don't, don't be silly! How could Briggs possibly break out of your uh, well, our prison? It's one of the strongest in Oceania. I don't know what happened, but before I knew it, they smashed a hole in the wall. There! The mast has been raised! Hey, what's up? Wait, you're supposed to be guarding the prisoners! What happened? It appears that Briggs has escaped! Uh, that's no good. What are you standing around for? Search the area, find Briggs at once! It, it might not be quite that easy. He's a pirate, after all. A famous one. Enough of that! Move it! Sorry, that's my phone. <laughs> Regardless, I'm going to inspect my boat. Oh, and Felix and his crew were there too, weren't they? I treated you like an honored guest in my home. Usually one feels a certain obligation to those who do them such kind service, am I right? Dude, we fixed the boat problem! You piece of garbage! <laughs> so don't just stand there, return the favor and find me Briggs! Come on, hurry up, let's go move it! Let's go see the boat. The mayor of Alhafra certainly does know how to look out for his own interests, doesn't he? That's one way of putting it. Well, what do we do? Do we go after Briggs? Nah, we're good. That's right. Why should we help the mayor after the way he treated you? Felix can decide himself, uh, for himself what to do. At the very least, I want to see the sailing ship now that it's fixed. Let's go outside and take a quick look. Yeah, it's not our problem. We captured them. <laughs> he broke out of your prison. It's your fault. <laughs> Ain't no reason why we gotta go take care of your problem. If you can't take care of your own problems, then, well, maybe you shouldn't be mayor. <laughs> I've been waiting for this day for years. I can't wait to set it sail across the Eastern Sea. Our, seal, uh, our, our sailboat looks fabulous with the mast repaired. You really must go check it out. If Briggs is smart, he's probably gone gone from Al Hafra, if you ask me. Ever since we heard Briggs broke out of jail, we've been a little nervous. Yeah, they make sure you go see the ship. The man was actually singing and skipping when he went to the dock. He seemed so pleased. I'm sure it's just a coincidence, but whenever you show up, trouble happens. Oh, come on! Dude, I'm not the one instigating it. Jeez! The whole town is grateful to you. Without your help, we wouldn't have fixed the mast. Huge boats carry more, but we need smaller ships to catch the wind. The mayor just doesn't understand this. The secret to harnessing the wind's power is building small ship. It... Wind's powers to building a small ship. Large ones can't do it. Once that stone was taken care of, it was really quite easy to raise the mast again. Well, as you can tell... Ow. Why do these things always happen to me? Stupid Briggs! Let me see some of the... parts of that. Briggs! Briggs, what are you... Where are you taking my boat? He's attempting to steal a thief, thief! Did you call me a thief? I paid for this boat fair and square. I'm no thief. 
You're the thieves. You tried to take our boat away after we paid you so much for it. I mean, she's not wrong. <laughs> You're the ones who stole our boat. Holly breaks. Uh oh, it's Felix. You're not afraid of them, are you? Look how far away they are. There's no way they can catch us now. You're right. They're stuck on the land. We've got this boat. They can't catch us. What would they do? Swim? <laughs> You're right. They can't board us from all the way over there. Wasn't there something you wanted to do next time you saw Felix? Don't tell me you forgot. It's all you ever talked about when you were in jail. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. Now's your chance. Do what you swore to do. <laughs> Is that the best you could come up with? <laughs> but Chichua, they're an awfully touch tough bunch. See? It's that attitude right there. That's why you'll never amount to anything. You know what? You're right. Hey, Felix! You guys take care and keep out half of us safe from thieves and pirates and politicians, too! What? <laughs> I doubt we'll ever meet again, but if we do, remember this. <laughs> That may have been a bit much, but you made him mad. Yeah, well, if you made him mad, he might chase us all the way back to Champa. <laughs> so, it got, you gotta love works. What? You let bricks get away! You and your friends talk about a good game, but when trouble happens, where were are you? Well, isn't this a fine mess? My prize ship stolen by a punch of filthy s pirate scum. Get up. They're gone, and you let them escape. You guys have royally botched this one. This ruins everything. You all ought to be ashamed. All of you were cowering while I was the only one who stood up to them. We'll stand up. Eh, that stood. Eh, whatever. All of you. I'm going back to my manor. And you, Felix, I'm extremely disappointed in you. There will be no reward. For you, Felix. Like, I would want a reward from you. Jeez. How about we just push you in the water? <laughs> you let that brick steal my ship. You're lucky I don't lock you up in his stead. Bah, I've had enough of this. Don't just stand there with your mouths gaping. Get out of here. We don't have a boat, so there's no reason for anyone to be here at the port. Return to town. Dude, that mayor needs to, like, have something. <laughs> there you go. He, he's a lot better than I would be. <laughs> I would have just said, uh, push you off the bridge, push you off the pier, I hope you can swim. If not, well, nothing was lost. Uh. What an awful person. Do you suppose he's always been self-centered? Self eh, probably. Yes, he's terribly irritating. You're quite right, Felix. I wager Prince is returning Champa to Champa personally. Well, it doesn't matter. I think I've had enough of this town. Shall we be leaving? Yeah, let's leave. Great. Let's leave as soon as possible, shall we? Yes. Yes, let's. 